Jackie, Jackie, Jackie. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. All right, good morning, brother. Good How morning, Sammy. Good, good. It's a Sunday. Uh, what is it? 7.04. August, August 27, 2023. Oh my God. This is a... This is a message uh, to the future generations. We're just trying to do this to help. We didn't get help when we were at your age. This is for high schoolers. So I hope you guys take advantage of what we're sharing here because if I would have heard this before, I would have had some sort of information like now. Like now we have it with Instagram and Facebook. It wasn't like this when we were growing up. I think it would have uh, set a whole foundation in my mind that is very different. Yeah, for sure. I'm starting to have that foundation right now, and it's kind of hard because I'm a little older. You become, um, what is it, uh, a habit, an animal habit was the, the phrase? Creature of habit. Yeah, creature of habit, and that's a big problem for us, for me, actually. So Sam is going to introduce the topic of today. All right, guys, so the, uh, we're going to pick a quote and dissect it. Um, it's going to be a quick uh, podcast, but uh, the uh, topic for today is uh, where the quote is, people begin to become successful the minute they decide to be. And this is from Harvey McKay. Um, if I pronounce your last name incorrectly, I'm sorry, but did the best I could. Um, go ahead. So this quote really hits hard for me. Life, personal experience, uh, I have to say that is very true. When you decide you're gonna be successful, you actually become so successful because your whole mindset changes. The mind controls everything around you. Mm -hmm. Like, if you think the glass is half full, you only get half of anything. If you see it as a positive thing, that like the glass is has liquid in there and you can take advantage that's what's gonna happen right uh, and i think from personal experience once you decide you're gonna do something and you push yourself right right it's like that other quote i heard on instagram um how how big would you dream if you know you wouldn't fail mm -hmm. why we don't dream because we think we have limitations exactly exactly and remember, i remember guys we're we were created by the almighty god we're creating his resemblance there's no there's no, no limit the only limit is in your mind and i think that's where it comes from that when the bible says that god created us in his image i don't think it means this form i think mm -hmm. it's more meaningful because if you look at it we're made from start dust right particles from planets and everything just mixed together. That's what mm -hmm. we are. We're part of the universe. So that gives us a edge. That's the way I see it. Mm -hmm. We think we're, we're more than just humans because what we think we become. Right. What we want, we can make it happen if we believe. And that's a very strong, strong idea if you mm -hmm. think about it. Mm -hmm. You know, I, I, that, uh, that quote is very powerful because like you said, the, uh, or another quote that I, I really like is a thousand a thousand mile journey begins with a single step. And that single step I think is your mind, taking control of your mind, taking control of your your, your foundation. A little pause, huh? we're back. Um so what were you saying about yeah, that? So I was saying the uh, one of the quotes that I really like is um, it's a thousand mile journey starts with a single step. And the single step is taking control of your mind because wherever your mind goes your attention goes um there was god damn it, there was more to to what i was saying and then i completely uh <laughs> got sidetracked i i think um uh, <laughs> yeah, me too uh let me just get my mind together again we got a little distraction so I think the first step, like you said, is your mind because that's what makes things happen. We believe it. Like, there's studies that stress causes diseases, cancers caused by your mind because mm -hmm. the stress, it has a lot of stuff going on. 
Right. You, there is that guy that you sent me that video on Instagram. It's crazy. That one that had cancer. And he said, I'm going nowhere. I'm not going to fucking die. Yeah. I'm not dying. Yeah, and he's still there. That's where I was going. Um, your mind is very important because we, you guys have 75, is it 75 trillion cell, cells in your body? And your mind is controlling everything, man. If, if you set the, uh, the tune for your cells. So if you're... If you wake up in the morning and it's like, God damn, man, I'm not having a good day. That sets the tone for your, for yourselves, man. So you, you're creating your own your own environment for yourselves. You create you you built the whole world though. You build your own universe. That's that's one way of seeing it. That you are a universe. You are exactly. another universe because I I don't know what's going in your head. I don't know you like that. In a sense, like we know each other, but then there's another whole person behind like a whole idea everything so yeah that's the way i i think each person is a universe and you can either create a fun universe or a chaotic one mm -hmm. sad depressed and it's, yeah. it's just you know this is it's a very pow powerful quote and it's the the same there's somebody else that says the same quote in other words like if you believe you can you're right. If you believe you can't, you're also Ooh, right. That's powerful. So th there's no limitations. Go out there and get it. Be hungry. You can do anything you want in life if you really put yourself into it. Those mm -hmm. ideas, you, you can get anywhere in life. Anywhere. And it's scary to think about it, too, because anything you want to do, it, if you really want it, you'll get it. Yeah. It can be good. It can be bad. That's the thing. And that's what a lot of people don't realize that I'm going to give you the perfect example. If you expect something back, bad to happen, it's going to eventually happen because you're bringing it to your life by your thoughts. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. By, you can create success and failure. So it's a, uh, what's it called? It's a sword with double, a double edged sword. Double edged sword, yeah. So it can do good or do bad. And that's the scary part. So. Yeah. Nowadays, what we're feeding to our minds by media, by <clears throat> TV, by movies, is just bad things. Mm -hmm. Just really bad things. What we see in TV is movies, the world being destroyed, just things happening left and right. Yeah. And <clears throat> because of that, I stopped watching the news because all they said is the stock market crash is mm -hmm. going to predict uh, another depression and this. So mm -hmm. you start building it in your mind. So what's going right. to eventually going to happen? You start expecting it. Eventually you're going to make it happen. Right. So what you got to do is do the opposite. Look for the positive. Look for people are saying there's always an opportunity. There's always what you want next to almost failing. There's always an opportunity in crisis. Yeah. So if, if the big majority of the people are believing a crisis is going to happen and it happens <clears throat> if you're looking at the other side of the coin there's always an opportunity to be had so you gotta make yourself believe there is nothing that can stop you pretty yeah. much yeah because if you believe you're gonna be stopped but anything you're gonna stop there's exactly. you have to change yourself you gotta stop believing whatever other people believe because they couldn't make it doesn't mean you can't make it. If you want it, you'll do it. Look mm -hmm. at all these people through history. Most of them, they didn't care. They just went for it and they believed they could do it. They push, they mm -hmm. suffer. Mm -hmm. Because most of the people that make it happen, they have to go through tests. Life is, uh, can't get anything without giving something back. Yeah. And I think sacrifice, that's what it is. You get mm -hmm. something back for giving something. I think life is a test, if you think about it. Life it is. is Proving yourself day by day. It's hard though. It's hard. Mm -hmm. Mostly we're too distracted with uh, the world that we stop realizing what we can do. Yeah. We're unstoppable, man. We're unstoppable. But we don't realize that. The, mm -hmm. the power of the mind, man, is just something else. You believe it, you create it. Look where we are. Yeah, the mind could either set you free or be your own prison. That's so powerful to think about. Because if you think you're sick, you're going to become sick. Yep. If you think you're healthy, you're going to become healthy. Yeah. If you want, believe that you can do anything, you'll do it. Yeah. I wanted more money. I got more money. Now I want freedom. 
and I'm gonna chase freedom. Let's get freedom and money. That's the goal. I want more free time and I'm gonna yeah. do it. I have to make it happen. And that's the goal that I have. I don't know why you guys have, but if you set yourself into the right path, you're gonna mm -hmm. do it because you believe in it. But mm -hmm. however, you gotta make it from a dream to a goal because there's a big difference. Like, it, Yeah, it's not gonna be easy. Don't think it's it's gonna be easy. Now, nah, if it was easy, everybody will do it. And that's where, that's what you gotta realize that not because it's hard, it's um, impossible. Like I say, in life, you have to give something in return of something else. It's equal exchange, it's trade. Mm -hmm. It's just like going to purchase something. You have to give your money, and to get your money, you gotta sacrifice your time. Mm -hmm. So at the end of the day, that's what life is. It's just... Um, it's an exchange of energy. Yeah. That's why capitalism works. Yep, yep. You're capitalism, you're exchanging your time, your valuable time for, for money. That's why communism doesn't work because it doesn't make sense that you're gonna get free things in life. That's yep. not how the universe works. That's not how life works. Yeah, there's nothing free. No, in life you want not have, uh, you wanna make your dreams come true, you're gonna have to suffer, you're gonna blood, sweat, and tears for that. And it makes sense, yep. it's what makes you. Yeah. And at the end of the day, you can sit down, look at all, everything you accomplish, and be like, okay, I did it. Doesn't feel horrible now, but at the time it did. But mm -hmm. that's the whole point. You learn. It's a lesson. Yeah. And we, we got to learn. We're starting a little older than we should have, but you never know. Sometimes it's the right time. Yeah. Because I think uh, if I would have had uh, what I have now when I was in my 20s, it would have been a mess. Cause I. I still don't know myself. I still don't know how to do things. I mm -hmm. still don't know how to handle myself the best way. I'm still not mature enough. But in my 20s, it would have been uh, more messy. It was a blessing in disguise. Yeah, because I didn't have the right mindset. I'm building it now. But in my 20s, I was all over the place. I was very um, weak emotionally because I used to let, allow my emotions take the well, best out of me. Thankfully, you're still in your early 30s. And I think to... I, I think the prime age for any men, man. I think it's considered your, your 40s and 50s. So there, there's still plenty of time to. And one thing I'm gonna send a message, and I think is uh, stop chasing and start attracting. Um, I'm gonna say this in relationship, right? Because in my 20s, I wanted a relationship. But what I had to offer, I had nothing to offer, no knowledge, I wasn't my best self. Mm -hmm. I had what I was looking for without giving anything in return. I was empty vessel. Mm -hmm. Now I see myself, I'm starting to fill the cup to that point I want. These yeah. kids that want to build the life with their partner, mm -hmm. but why they have nothing? Right. And it's, it's hard to accept that. Yeah. You want, yeah, it's nice to think that it's going to be like a Disney movie, but like I said, you can become anything, but first you have to become. Mm -hmm. How do you want to have the perfect family if you have nothing to offer too? <laughs> so that's a whole thing. You gotta build yourself to be able to give more. Yeah. That's the problem. I think now they teach you you the American dream, get a house, family, kids. Oh, well, how can you do that if you don't even have a foundation of yourself? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I know that this drifted a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So nothing is impossible. We can make it happen. We can fight against anything and build it. That's that's the whole thing. You are em you are an empty canvas. Mm -hmm. Man, man, we we don't have any value and we build it. That's from Andrew Tate. Yeah, and it's so true, bro. <laughs> that is so true. I feel like every uh, every episode you have to at least throw one. Uh, I I like Andrew, that guy. Andrew Tate in there. I like the guy. What can I say? Yeah. That, uh, there's some videos that I don't agree, but that's what life is. His opinion sometimes I think are. Nah, I don't really agree with some stuff, but most of the stuff he says, I do agree. Mm -hmm. Do I live to a lot of stuff he says? Sadly, no, but that's where you got to build yourself to. Yeah. Um, you know, he, he has valuable, uh, valuable uh, points, attributes, and points of view. Yeah. I'm going to say it like this. A guy has money. Yeah, he has some legal issues, but he's living a life. That maybe someday we can live in the science. Yeah, he's in, he was in prison at home. Mm -hmm. Still living better than when I was. Yeah. At yeah, home. that's not. 
I'm way, aiming to be when I see my life. But uh, yeah, he's, he's living well and good kudos to him. Well, the thing is he has time. Yeah. Freedom. Well, he has freedom. I don't know how much freedom. But if mm -hmm. you see a guy like that being persecuted by the media, he's doing something right. Yeah, yeah, no, for sure, for sure. Because if you tell me, bro, the media doesn't go against anybody. They don't have any fears. Oh. Yeah. He, he motivated a lot of kids to be different. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. A lot of men that were not being men. Yeah. And uh, his words hit hard. You look at yourself in the mirror, like, do you start wondering if you're really a man of, mm -hmm. of value? And that helps. Yeah. It's sad to look at yourself in the mirror and be like, <laughs> what can I offer? You know? Yeah. But that, I don't want to throw any rocks at anybody, but I see a lot of people that I, that are older than us. I'm like, what the fuck, bro? What mm -hmm. do you have to offer? And I don't mean it just money-wise. I mean in knowledge. I mean personality, and I mean a lot more. Yeah. But that's why they didn't, they didn't have any goals or anything. They didn't want to become something else. Mm hmm So what do you think? About what? About that whole topic. <laughs> <laughs> I see what I had to say. That was a quick, uh, quick little topic for me. Okay, so I think we don't have anything else to say. Just become who you want to become. Look at yourself in the mirror every day. And just do it. There's, um, you become what you, your mind tells you. That's it. That's it. I, I, I want to I wanna become something. I know I'll do it. But you got to believe it. You got to feel it. Close your eyes. Believe you're living that life. And it mm -hmm. will eventually going to happen. Yeah. Think you want that car. You're going to have to find a way. But dream. Close your eyes. Dream you're in that car. And you have it in your possession. Low, ma low manifestation, right? Right. Uh, just law, search. Law of attraction. Law of attraction. Yeah. yeah. Just search it, guys. It sounds crazy, but uh, I'm I'm a living proof of it. Mm -hmm. Not at the biggest levels of it, but in the smallest levels. Yeah. You want it, you'll find it. Yep. That's that's why there's that saying: "Be careful what you wish for." Mm -hmm. Be careful what you wish for. And a uh, quote from Sammy: "Life is a genie." Mm -hmm. So. That's what we got to be careful yep. what we wish for. Yep. All right. I think pretty much that's it. So. Check it out. Thank you for watching, guys, and listening. Have a great day. Have a Peace. good day, guys.